What's up, everybody? My name is Vincent. Welcome to Cryptolution, where we talk about everything under the moon in the crypto universe. Guys, today I have another exciting video to share with you, and that is a new platform that is called Myria. Now, Myria is a platform, a gaming hub for gamers alike. It's a gamer's paradise. There are multiple play to earn games that you can find on this website and on the platform itself. And it's currently in the works. We are early on and this is why it's a good time to be watching this video throughout its entirety because you don't wanna miss a single piece of this information because you could be a part of the next generation of an amazing blockchain game that is built on a ZK rollup and layer two scaling solution. Now guys, we're gonna be talking about all these amazing things and why I'm so bullish on this platform and why we can expect the roadmap ahead to be very very beneficial to people who participate now so guys with that said as always be sure to like up that button subscribe to the channel don't forget to join our patreon page and most importantly please be careful to any of the scammers down in the comments below i'll never reach out via whatsapp telegram direct messaging or email so please be careful and invest safely. So guys, this video is brought to you by Myria. Now, the number one thing I wanna share with you guys is basically who's leading in this industry, who's leading in Myria. And as you can see here, these industry veterans come from all walks of life. And these are the names that you definitely wanna be seeing when you're working, investing, and playing on a blockchain game. And those leaders include Ubisoft, Activision, EA, Blizzard, Marvel, Riot Games, Gameloft, Epic Games, Goldman Sachs, and Tencent, guys. These are leaders. These are AAA gaming studios who have proven that they've had a great track record, made billions of dollars, and now Myria has these people working under their belt. And that's the team I want to see. Now, let's go ahead and understand a few things about Myria. Number one, we need to understand that Myria is a layer two solution, right? So what does that mean? Well, we do know that Ethereum, at least as a blockchain, is very congested sometimes. And when it does get congested, that means that transactions can be very expensive and transactions can take a little bit longer to go through. Well, with this layer two solution, with Myria's layer two solution, which we're gonna talk about a little bit, allows for people to have at least 9,000 transactions per second with like zero gas fees and trading. That's what you want to hear. This is almost better than some other blockchains. We can compare this to Solana and BNB where the transaction fees are like literally fractions of a penny. And basically this is the exact same thing. So when you want to have your Ethereum NFTs uh, and sell them for a cheap price and that if you were to buy one, that the transaction fee was cheap and that it just went through quickly. Well, that's exactly what this is. Next up, we got to talk about security because security is the most important thing. And Ethereum has the best security out there because there are so many validators that approve of a transaction. But also, let's think about layer twos, right? So in a way, layer twos help scale the project, but you also risk security. But Myria has developed a way to make sure that these uh, NFTs that you have in your wallet, that your funds are protected, that there aren't going to be any hacks. And you have to do your own research. And please, none of this is financial advice, but you have to do your own research when you invest in companies. And when I look at Myria, they definitely seem to be in the right lead because they've learned from other pe people's mistakes. So you got to look at this and be like, okay, they have the right scaling solution, but they also have the security check on point. As of right now, that is so amazing. Now, let's talk about the contributing to the future of decentralized internet because we got to understand who's behind the team. Now, the team is great, and I've highlighted just a few. Let's talk about Andrew Silber, who is the co-founder and CTO. He does actually have some recognizable names that are from industries such as Activision, Electronic Arts, 2K, Ubisoft, Sony, and Midway. Now, these are great experiences, and I'm glad that this person is the CTO of the project, allowing the team to have great execution through the expansion in their roadmap. And then we have Jonathan Teo, who is the CEO and co-founder. Now he also was founding aliens.com before and also a blockchain SaaS platform. So it allows him to understand that we have a person who understands gaming, but understands blockchain gaming, right? And that heads over to the head of blockchain. We have to understand that we have to bring more people and that is this person, Brendan. Brendan brings a decade of experience in the blockchain. He has founded an escrow solution on the Bitcoin blockchain, a crypto ETF on Ethereum, and was blockchain lead for the world's largest trade finance blockchain network. Next up, we have Damien Ordish, who is also the CPO. In his role leading to the people team, Damien helps Myria connect, develop, and care for a global team. Damien brings decades of experience to Myria and was previously global head of people for BitMEX. And prior to that, an imagining director in HR at Goldman Sachs, guys. Pretty big deal, pretty big deal. Then we have Ivan. Ivan has a lot of experience with Gameloft, Crazy Labs, and also Ubisoft. And then we have AJ. AJ has had some experience as a art lead 
as an art creative lead, and his experience happens to be working with Nike, Adidas, and Microsoft as those top brands. And last but not least, we have the partner lead who has worked with Marvel and Tencent. These things I wanna to highlight to you guys, because this is the team behind Myriad. Don't sleep on this. Now you guys probably wanna understand what games are being developed and what are in the works right now. Now these games haven't released yet, they're in the work, but they are pretty fun to do. Now Meta Rush is an interesting game because it involves you running around and hopefully you don't tip over, but you're racing against your other competitors and you have to fight through these different courses in order to get from point A to point B. It's quite simple, but you can tumble over, but it's so fun, this type of thing you can play on your uh, Macintosh computer, you can play it on your PC computer, you can play it on Androids. That's the really cool thing is that it allows you to play anywhere you are. You can play in the convenience of at work or at your own home and earn some tokens. Next up, we also have Metacart. Metacart is pretty much like a Mario Kart, and but the only difference is you can actually make money off of this. Same thing, you can you know play it on your Androids, you can play it on your PCs and Macs, but what I find really interesting about this is that you can actually earn the token rewards, and all you have to do is just outsmart your players, guys. So I, I see a lot of Mario Kart in here, but I just want to be able to earn money while I'm playing, and I'm familiar with this, so why shouldn't you? And then next up, we got the really fun ones. These are the two I'm really excited about, and that is Block Royale. Now, Block Royale is like a third-person shooter. Basically, you just have to be the last one standing, but you're going to have to fight other people in these crazy worlds. And as you can just see, based on these effects, these crazy worlds are pretty legit. This is some AAA quality studio, because obviously, we want to be able to play a game that actually has great effects. And this actually stands out for that. So I'm really excited for this, you know, last man standing game. But even this one right here, who knows what this is? It looks like a chicken, but it's flying in the air and it's about to head down to that battle zone. That is a really big map in my opinion. That's where we have to think is scale, scale, scale. Now, Star Strike Legends is kind of similar to the other game, which is a third person, first person shooter game. But the only difference is here, your motivation is different. It's not the last man standing. It's actually, you have to go to certain areas to activate bombs all across the map. And say, for instance, you have your own bomb that you've activated, well, you have to defend it. And so you have to keep those things activated in order to defend. That's really fun. It's kind of like Halo in a sense. And this is where we bring these AAA gaming studio strategies and also gamer experience as well. So I'm really excited for Star Strike Legends. Next up, we have Moonville Farms. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but there are a lot of different games out there that involve farming. And farming is actually one of the most beneficial ways because you can start earning tokens because you built a city, because you built a farm. And it farms and it yields money for you. And all you have to do is build and strategize and building the right place. Once you build a city, once you build infrastructure, let the city make money for you while you sleep. That's why I love Moonville's farm, and there's definitely a great game to have on this platform. Now, this one is only for the web. It's not only, uh, available for Androids or uh, Macintosh computers or iPhones, but that's okay. Again, we never know what's going to happen. This may be integrated later. Now, let's talk about the comprehensive blockchain gaming platform, which basically we need to understand what Myriad is. We do know that Myriad Studios has the different partners that they have and the different dApps and also the experiences of their members and teams. So this allows for great games and applications to be involved. But what's also nice is that the platform itself has its own NFT marketplace, their own wallet, and also their own game platform. And this has also helped with its layer two scaling solution that helps build a layer one solution in some way. So it almost conveniently works together to work better for you so that it feels like a layer one solution, but using layer two scale up. So that's really beneficial. The infrastructure tools are helpful as well. Again, that's a ZK roll up. Now, as you can see from this map, you can understand that the Myriad Games has different strategies, right? They have the different partner games because you can actually, if you're a game developer, which we'll talk about in a little bit, you can actually include your game in here. And then once that's done, you merge those games into Myriad Games, you have the Myriad Zero Knowledge. But also, if you want to be a node validator, which we will talk about, you can validate the blocks. So these blocks are the transaction fees. And again, they can go up to 9,000 transactions per second. So these nodes, they have you know some role to it. They have the governance, the oracles, the redundant storage needs. So these node validators are very important to the ecosystem. Now let's talk about the ZK rollups because we need to understand what is the ZK rollup and it is this Stark based ZK rollup. Now Myriad's Ethereum layer two scaling solution uses zero knowledge technology to roll up or bundle thousands of layer two transactions into one single transaction. This then sends validity proof back to the main blockchain, preserving the security of L1 Ethereum. Myriad's Stark based ZK rollup solutions enabled NFT NFTs and dApps to achieve ultimate scale, low transaction fees without sacrificing on security. Now, if you're interested, now this is the part where we talk about being a node validator. Now we do know Gala Games has their own node validators, but the unfortunate thing is it's a little bit too late to be a part of the node validators because being a node validator is so expensive. So if you want to be a node validator now as a second chance with Myriad with a top gaming AAA quality team behind it, well, you can actually start pre-registering now. And all you have to do is just go to their website 
and just make sure to enter your email and you will have the up-to-date information to become a node validator at possibly a cheap entry point. So if you get in early, you can actually start earning money as well. And if you're looking further to develop in this space and you want to be a part of the team further than just being an investor world, they actually have some positions here. You can either be a data person, you can have engineering and remote locations. Again, the thing is they are all over the place. You don't have to move somewhere. You can literally live where you are and work remotely. They have expressed to me that their team members are all over the world. It's not just one place and they're wanting to expand. So if you want to be a part of this, say for instance, an executive producer of a new game, well, this is your chance. And all you have to do is just fill in those jobs. And there's so much to this. There's art directors, there's art positions. I mean, guys, the list goes on and on. So if you want to be a part of this, be a part of the team, this is the section you need to be looking at. And if you haven't already, be sure to follow them on Twitter because you need to stay up to date with what's going on within the games. And once they come out, you want to be the first one to be notified. But what I found really interesting was who was following them. And that was playtoearn.net, which I follow in terms of all the blockchain games. They definitely do a great job reporting to whatever's developing the play to earn space, but also has helped me evaluate how many blockchains have the best games and where they stand in terms of rank. Then we have Johnny, who's also a host of in-game for Crypto Banter, but also for Hustlepedia for his own YouTube channel. So obviously him following that makes me feel trusting. And also Lark Davis, who's also another YouTube influencer. And then when I checked his page, he was giving a whitelist giveaway. And not only that, he actually is an investor of Myria. If that doesn't, I love Lark Davis. He's an amazing person. He's a huge supporter of different, like a lot of different games and the games that he does choose. It's very limited. He's very picky in what he chooses in terms of play to earn gaming. Now, if you were a developer and you want to develop on this platform, well, you can start developing with them by just going to start building and you can contact them. You can start learning how you can develop with the team, build and leverage this Myria play to earn platform and make the company better. And you can become part of a new generation, a new movement in this. Myria is more than just a game. They are building an entire blockchain ecosystem with tokens, nodes, NFT marketplace, and AAA studio games. Now guys, if you don't know, you can actually sign up for a free mint. Now, if you go to the upper right hand side, there's a free Seagull NFT section. You just click on that category. I'll take you to this page, but you just need to know that it's gonna be coming soon. The Alliance Seagull claim will be launching soon. Which Alliance will you choose? Which Seagull NFT will be yours? Again, this is a free NFT mint and all you have to do is just sign up for their newsletter. And what's really cool about this is that there's a story behind it. So you go to the Medium article, which I'll post in the link in the descriptions below. This has a chapter that describes the storyline behind these seagulls and what these NFTs will mean for you. So guys, don't miss out on this. This is something that I've warned you about. Again, this video is very exciting for me because again, this team is amazing and the roadmap is amazing. The platform is amazing. I see this actually excelling and being in the billion dollar family. I mean, again, just my own personal opinion, not financial advice, but I definitely see this being a huge competitor to Gala Games, Vulcan Forge, and other gaming platforms that are just coming out right now. This is such a huge thing. Now guys, that about wraps up the video. Make sure to click on the affiliate links below. I have all the links for you to check out all their social media feeds and also for you to sign up for a free NFT. So guys, check those out right now. Don't miss out, join their Discord, join their Twitter, join everything. So guys, thank you so much for supporting this. Leave a comment down below if you're bullish on Myria token, if you're bullish on being a node validator, and if you're bullish on the games as well. I love to hear your thoughts. And as guys, as always, be sure to like up that button, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to join our Patreon page. And I'll see you guys next time.